Previously on Ran the Man's Comedy Entertainment. What the heck? Sam, turn that music off. What the heck was you thinking, man? What's wrong with you? I was just having a small gathering, you know? <laughs> you know, good and well, you're not supposed to be throwing no party up in here, man. Man, now the neighbors have already complained about you once. You're trying to get Ram in trouble. Shut up, Tim. Man, don't be telling me to be quiet. I have told you about telling me to be quiet. Sam, how could you? What you be doing when I'm not here, man? I can't believe you. Bro, I was just having a small gathering, you know. I thought I'd just have a couple of friends over. So I had Jeffrey come over, man. I don't even want to hear it, man. I don't even want to hear it. And now, get ready for part two of When Your Brother Throws a Party. Bro, why the heck would you want to throw another party, man? Like, seriously, like, what's wrong with you? You, man. I mean, the neighbors already complained once. once. You didn't already had Michael Jackson complaining and everything, and you want to throw another party? I'm not doing that. I'm not throwing another party. I'm telling you that right now. Bro, what you talking about, bro? The last party was a banger, bro. What are you talking about? Oh, we can't throw another party. Man, the last party was lit, bro. Oh, the last party was a banger, bro. Oh, so you're not trying to do that again, bro? How are you not trying to do that again? Yeah, everything was fine until the neighbors started complaining. Everything was fun until the neighbors started complaining. Why Why you you just forget that, bro? You don't remember Er, Blackson, EO, Michael Jackson? Eh, everybody was complaining, bro. You want to throw another party? I'm sorry, I ain't with that. Because I ain't trying to have neighbors complaining again, bro. Bro, that's why I had to kick you out the house. I don't even know why you're still here, to be honest. A few complaints ain't going to do nothing, bro. Oh, you know the neighbors are crazy. They're going to do that anyway. You're trying to get me in trouble. You trying? Uh, are you trying to get me in trouble, Sam? Is that what you're trying to do? You trying to get me in trouble? Oh, yeah, that all sound um, real good and everything. And that sound real good, but I'm telling you, bro, we skating on thin ice. Ice, the neighbors have had to call and complain twice about this loud, loud music, man. I do not want, want there to be a third time. All right, we're walking on a thin line right now, bro. I'm telling you. You know how it is? It, do you know that, bro, they already feel, the neighbors already feel like we disrespecting them already. And if we throw another party, they might call the cops. I don't know. They might call the cops on this, bro. So come on, bro. I'm trying to have fun, man. I'm trying to get lit, bro. How you not trying to get lit? You feel me, Jeffrey? When that party lit, man? Yes, Sam, I believe you. <laughs> Ram, you need to loosen up, sweetheart. You need to loosen it up and relax. Yeah, like Jeffrey said, you need to loosen up, Ram. For me. What'd you say, Jeffrey? Ew. What? Ew.
Ugh. Oh, what'd you just say? What'd you just say? Hey, hey, neighbors always be complaining. Yeah, they always be complaining. But they might call the cops, bro. You want to go to jail? I don't. Oh, I ain't been to jail all my life, bro. Oh, I ain't trying to go to prison, bro. Oh, and I'm not trying to go to jail L L for you. What, you want to go to jail, bro? I don't. I most definitely don't want to go to jail. So I'm not about to throw another party, man. I'm not about, I'm telling you, I'm not about to throw no more parties, bro. Oh, boy. Oh, it's just no, it, it just seems like there's just no getting through to you, Sam. I'm telling you, every time I'm, bro. Oh, I'm not about to throw no more parties, bro. And besides, uh, don't nobody trying to hear about, uh, uh, you know we don't celebrate Valentine's Day anyway, so I don't know oh, why, I, yeah, I know Valentine's Day is coming up, uh, but you know we don't celebrate that anyway, so. I don't even know why you're bringing that up, to be honest with you. Eventually. Matter of fact, I believe my boy Oi Oi uh Buck, he got a song called Billy Jean Nightmare. Here. Put that song on, bro. Oh, hit that song on your iPad, man. And hit that song on on, on the phone, bro. Yeah. I got some good news for you. Huh? What? For real, man? For real? Yeah, man. Yeah. Wait, for real? The restaurant stock has gone up 50%? Larry, you ain't jiving, is you? You ain't joshing with me now, are you? No way, silly. I can't believe it. Oh, man. I just can't believe it. Wait till I tell Rev about this. He's going to be But so there are some excited. bad news. What? What's the bad news? What's the bad news, Larry? The store's been robbed. Somebody did what? The store's been robbed. What do you mean the restaurant got robbed? Stole all the money. Somebody actually stole something from the restaurant? Oh my gosh, man. Rams not gonna be happy about that at all. Alright. Thanks for telling me, Larry. Yeah. I'll make sure Ram knows about it. I'll tell Ram right now. Oh my gosh. 
I feel so sorry. Ram's not going to like this. He's not going to like this. Well, I guess I better tell him and tell him the bad news. Clear for us to throw a party again. Oh, someone's calling. Hello? Hey, what's up, Tam? What is it? Hey, Graham! Oh, yeah, you got some good news for me. What's the good news, Tam? I got some good news and I got some bad news, bro. Well, the good news is, is Larry just called me not too long ago. The stock just went up, up, bro. Oh, the stock of the restaurant just went up, up, fifty percent, bro. What? For real? You? Know, you serious? But unfortunately, I do have some bad news too. What happened? What's the bad news, Tam? Well, Larry also told me the restaurant just got robbed. What?